Hey guys, we're on the side of a highway right now in Manila. <laughs> so we now have a kitten. Manila is madness. Oh boy. Now Jessica's really gonna kill me. My friends, you want my picture? Imagine when it's my friends. <laughs> That's my team at life. Is yeah. that Driver dropped us off at the wrong spot. So now we have to take a train, which is a huge pain for this family. If you've seen us before, we suck at going through these little turnstiles with barcodes. Okay. We're in the wrong part of the airport. We gotta take a train to the other part that we're supposed to be in. Wall Lumpur hates us. Now we have to scan our ticket to get out. Hey, we're missing one. I don't know where it is. We need to go and get our plane. <laughs> Thank you. Just been notified that our flight is delayed by two hours. Woke up at the crack of dawn. Did I mention I love moving day? I love it. I love it. Finally getting on the plane. Nice little touch here. They just hand you five orders of food and five water bottles. What? Why would you hand this to me? Why? Why would you hand me the food now? No, my hands aren't full. Parent with three young kids, carry on bags, four other little backpacks. Instead of just serving us food on the plane, why don't you wait like every other airline and just give me food when I'm sitting in my seat? We are in the Philippines. We're in Manila. The kids are riding moving sidewalks, so of course they're happy. And Jessica's happy because they've already got Christmas decorations up, which supposedly has been set up since September. Okay. No one found this. I'm at the beach. My new car. Cool. We're only eating sushi from Japan. Why? Because the last sushi place that you begged me to go to, Sushi King in Malaysia, was absolute poop again! Here comes the fun police. Wee wee wee, fun police. Everett, what are you feeling right now? Exhaust. Oh. The lazy bones, aren't you? I bet you he'll be less tired if he gets ice cream. We got rained out yesterday. It was a nice day. I spent the whole day inside editing a video. So my first time out is this. Why? We went to a movie theater and we watched Lyle. Crocodile. It's about a crocodile that can sing, but he has safe flight. But at the end of the movie, he actually can sing on a stage. Where are we right now? McDonald's. Right. We are at Jollibee. First it's time trying it. Chicken, rice, pasta, a little bit of everything. side of a highway right now in Manila. Jessica's directing us where to go to see a park. This is how you get here on this sidewalk. And you got it all over your forehead. <laughs> What's wrong, Nolan? Did you get that sweaty arm on your face? Yeah. <laughs> remember, the, remember that movie where the guy oh, yeah. along He's came Polly? Yeah. That guy didn't seem to mind at all. Straight up walking into oncoming traffic on the highway. 
Manila is madness. I kept saying to Jess, no one's wearing sandals. It's so hot, but no one's wearing sandals. Now we know why. Everett just stepped in a huge pile of... And he really wasn't happy about it. We're almost there, buddy. Did you wipe your hands? They were pretty filthy. We aren't going to... Oh my God, look how dirty your rag is just from cleaning your hands and your face. And then you got this guy. The garbage collector over here. I'm a dirt squirrel, baby. So we just found a baby kitten on the ground. He's just laying on the ground, looks dead. But he's alive, which is good news. But now what? Okay, put it, put it kind of flat. He needs mama milk. See? He needs mama milk. He needs mama milk. Should we take this to an animal shelter? He needs milk, or else he's gonna die. His, his eyes aren't even open yet. Yeah, we better give him milk. So we now have a kitten. Um, just walk into an animal clinic, see what they can tell us or do for us. Obviously, we can't keep him, so. He's super cute, though. His eyes aren't even open yet. It's mom lesson, so we're gonna try and take him to an animal shelter now. We are outside of BSF, which is. That's an animal clinic here in uh, BGC. They're taking the kitten in. Uh, I already don't like the sounds of it. Sounds like I'm gonna have to pay money, which I don't want to. I just wanted them to be like, okay, we'll take the kitten and uh, find it a home or something, but I really, like, we can't do anything, so I don't know what to do here. Just help me the owner of the kitten. No, I'm not the owner of the kitten. I said, did you just say the owner? The vet just talked to us. Our options are to put the cat back where we found it and pray that the mother comes back, contact Kara BGC, which is a foundation that takes care of cats, or feed it for another seven to eight weeks, every three to four hours. Not gonna happen, I don't think. I really wanna feed the cat. We got some cat milk, or kitten milk, but now we need to find a syringe so we could feed it. I love animals, but this is really inconvenient. Nobody wants this kitten. Nobody wants this kitten. Every person that comes by, <laughs> and the boys go up to them and go, you want a free baby kitten? Dad, you started something here that was a bad idea. <laughs> Guys, stop talking to people about kittens. Oh boy. Now Jessica's really gonna kill me. I came back by myself to try and find the mom and hopefully I could drop the kitten off seeing that the mom would be here. We gave it some milk and we we're trying to do our best. I came back here and I found another kitten. <laughs> we found another kitten, but no mom, so now we have two kittens. Now what do I do? I don't even think I could bring them into my hotel. Reunited these two guys. Just gonna give the other guy some food, some of this milk. Hopefully he takes it. Everyone's looking at me in this village like, what is this guy doing? Like, why is he taking care of these cats? He's drinking it. I don't know what to do now. Hello. You guys want to take care of some kittens? What? You like kittens? No. <laughs> no? They don't like them. Look at how cute these guys are. Come on, nobody wants to take care of them. All right, cat update. So a person came out of the store and said that they have seen a mom around. So. A third one, a third little kitten came out. Let's put them all together in the container. Nice little warm bed that they have. Hopefully the mom comes back and saves the day. I am back with the family. The kids are happy that the mother came back and helped all the little- I'm not happy. I'm not. Okay, so we are at, what's this place called? BGC? <laughs> We, we are at BGC for all that kitten saving. Made us hungry, so we, uh, instead of getting food, we just ate a whole bunch of ice cream and milkshakes. That's what we had for dinner tonight. This place is amazing. One long street lined with stores. Every store you could possibly think of. Every awesome restaurant you could think of. They got Christmas decorations everywhere. And it's just like people everywhere. Chilling out, eating, shopping. Everything's open, it's pretty late. It's still, everything's still open. 
and we just passed like four intersections and we still didn't get to the end. So I don't know where this ends, but I can't take any more walking or any more stores. Everything you could possibly want is here. Manila is awesome. Good night, YouTube. See you tomorrow. Look at my bandit I have now. I have four. The bandit's everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Good afternoon from. Where can I move that? We just spent four hours trying to get through to Air Asia, and we still don't have the itinerary for our flight that we need. It's now 2.30 in the afternoon, and we're trying to get out of here to so go get some food and see a little bit more of Manila. That's our story for today. tried two different banks and because of Air Asia's stupid charges probably flagged our cards and now nothing's working we can't take out any money as much as everyone glorifies the international travel it's not always rainbows sometimes it really sucks where did you get that tape from what you got the tape from the ground and then you put it on your mouth Let's not do that anymore. So we're gonna test out our credit card at the 7-Eleven. Hopefully it works. 7-Eleven only takes cash. We are winning today. We're gonna need something big to change this day around. Right. So we called the grabs. Two minutes before it arrived, it said it canceled on us. So another bonus. But we just came to Metro Bank and our card worked. So we got some money. We're back on track. <laughs> Hi. You here for Dan? Yeah. Dan. Dan, yeah. Yeah. Should I sit in the front? Yeah, sure. Okay. No problem. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I'm going to put my bag here, buddy. Sit on your bum. Sit on your bum. No. No, sit on your bum. Nope. Nolan, sit down, bum. please. Oh, yes. Air conditioning is so nice. <laughs> oh, my God. Get higher. What's your name? <laughs> Mitchell. Mitchell. Nice to meet you, Mitchell. Nice to meet you, too, sir. Sir Dan, right? Yes, sir. to head to a camera store so we are right in central manila it is a different world here it is No. So every street here is lined with camera stores, but there's so many little shops in front of it, you can't even see what's in the back. <laughs> so I don't know if I'm passing the store or not, but it is busy. Yesterday we were in a place that was full of designer stores and restaurants. And it had basically everything you could need at a price. Here, you have the exact same thing. Everything you need, food, clothing, Restaurants, it's everything you could need, but a different world. That's why Manila is so awesome. Thank you. That's a better choice. Instead of buying something, you gave him your money? Uh, I, still have I still have 20 pesos to buy this. Uh, good job, buddy. That's nice. All right. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Nice to meet you. <laughs> you got to go on this side. There you go. Say hi. <laughs> How'd you get a scooter in here? <laughs> uh, yeah, it smells good. <laughs> Say hi. <laughs> yeah. What's up, man? Yeah. 
name? What's your name? No, no, we're gonna share our grapes with our friends. Yeah, yeah sure. Sharing is nice. Oh, oh, you're dropping them on. Okay, here, you guys share, because they're freaking. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 don't take them all! Hi, friends, you want my picture? You want to put my friends? <laughs> so we're just back at Jollibee because we couldn't find anywhere else to eat. It was just madness. That was quite the experience. <laughs> I've never experienced anything like that before. <laughs> I was getting kind of claustrophobic at times, but the kids, I was panicking a bit, but the kids were super cute. What did you guys think of that? Watch that juicy. It was perfect. Dad, wait, that adult watched our videos? Yeah. Isn't that cool? Thank you. Well, thank you. All right, thank you so much. Appreciate it. So we are headed back. Hey, guys. We are headed back with food and candy to see our little friends. Hannah really, really wanted to go back and give the little boy some Jolly Bee. So we're going back. Everett! Everett! You like that one? Yeah, you like it? Okay, YouTube. An amazing day. So I think that's it for us. Say bye, guys. Bye! Hi, YouTube! <laughs> <laughs> day of my life, is yeah. that just a day of my life back here. Oh.